the years that they're coming, tourism, traveling tourism, they're going to be really the protagonist in, for the European market. It's more and more experiences. It's more personalized kind of uh, service offers. It's certain kind of uh, people want to really experience something new and I think there's something different. Tourism and travel, the authentic experiences and the economy growth that creates is a big challenge for everybody. And the reason is that they, cr they are created a lot of jobs, uh, that they benefit local communities. All the panellists today were united in saying how critically important travel and tourism is as a global industry, um, how uh, an incredibly effective stimulator of jobs, of uh, economic benefit, of social value, of cultural preservation, of environmental protection um, tourism can be, and yet it's not uh, sufficiently reflected as such within either EU policy or EU structure, and we'd love to see that changing. We often talk about the importance of tourism for growth but also for the creation of jobs uh, but then we often forget to also say that we really need uh, social progress in order to promote tourism to have really sustainable tourism and that means that we need to make sure that everybody who works has the right to leisure time so mainly by having annual paid leave and you know reduction of working time have a decent salary so because this is the very basis of, of tourism people can only go on tourism if they have really uh, good working conditions some of the challenges for sustainability in terms of really driving uh, low carbon sustainable tourism is the fact that it really is up to um, the, uh, the industry to invest in uh, low carbon technologies but is not necessarily rewarded as such um, in the marketplace from uh, an incentivization um, or a market benefit position. We have to find a way that I think we are working together with the private sector and I think together with the member states, regions and local authorities because I think this is kind of a network which I think that are, I think that, that if it's functioning well it provides the results that, that we are aiming at. It's the right time right now for Europe to take the initiative for an integrated uh, European policy for tourism because it's going to be the benefit for all. For any future tourism policy, tourism strategy, we really have to have a strong social pillar because we see also a lot of disruption if those rights of workers and the, and the working conditions are not respected. All is about people. Tourism is all about people and tourism also creates this environment uh, because um, brings peace and prosperity and, and creates a better world to live in.